Learning a programming language is one thing. Making money out of it is a totally different subject. While there are thousands of programmers out there working as developers and designers, not everyone hits the jackpot when it comes to earning big money. Reason is they're possibly targeting the wrong programming language. Software development is a high paying field if you do the right things and seek out the best opportunities. Even though we learn a lot of programming languages throughout our developer journey, it's hard to pick one language that can make us the big bucks. What's the magic language that can transform us from average earning programmers to highly paid professional developers? As far as getting paid is concerned, you need to understand the role and application of languages preferred by the industry and current software developers. Did you know that Python fell considerably this year in the highest paying programming languages? Surprised? Well, that's how technology is changing, so better be prepared to adapt to it. Since different programming languages serve different purposes, it mainly depends on your preferred field. So to make the job easier, I'll talk about some of the top programming languages that you should learn that can earn you big money and prepare you for the future tech industry as well. First, what the stats suggest. For this video, I'm gonna leverage the 2021 developer survey that Stack Overflow conducted to determine the highest paying programming languages. The data comes from a web survey where Stack Overflow collected responses worldwide to understand the latest trends in software industry. There is a good sampling with over 46,000 participants. Like always, the major chunk of contributors to the survey comes from the United States and India. More importantly, the states in the US, which had more established tech industries like New York, Washington, Texas, and California, featured most in the survey responses from that country. The results suggest that Perl is no longer the highest paid language and slipped to fifth place this year's survey. Now Clojure enjoys the top spot with a median salary of about $95,000. Interestingly, no language comes even close, as F Sharp enjoys second spot with an annual median salary of just over $81,000. Even though some other notable languages like Rust, Python, Ruby, Java, and JavaScript didn't make to the top selection, they remain some of the most consistent development languages and one of the most preferred choices by the industry. So first, what's Clojure? Ever since Clojure has been recognized as the top paying language, everyone wants to know more about it. It's a general purpose programming language like Python and Java, featuring an interactive scripting development environment. More importantly, it features multi-thread programming infrastructure that makes it more robust and efficient to work with with the latest platforms. In 2021, Clojure was voted as the highest paying programming language as it yielded a median salary $14,000 more than F Sharp. When you work with Clojure, you can easily access Java frameworks with type hints and type interface. This makes sure that your Java calls are not reflected. If you have worked with Lisp, it should be much easier for you to learn Clojure. Even though it's general purpose, Clojure mainly uses functional programming with persistent data structures. Moreover, these data structures are immutable, but you can access mutability through transactional memory system. Given that it's the highest paid programming language in 2021, it's easy to understand why you need to learn this language for the future too. Some other things that you should know about Clojure are, it features a runtime polymorphism, you can perform concurrent programming, and it supports a dynamic development. Next, what are some other promising highly paid languages? While Clojure officially won the tag for the highest paid programming language in 2021, there are some other languages that are very important that deserve mention here. Why? Well, the tech industry is quickly changing place and trends continuously change every six months to a year. So even though Clojure remains the top language for 2021, you can't be sure that it'll always stay the top for the coming years. So what languages have a better chance of consistently reaching the top ranks? Well, it's important to understand the modern frameworks primarily use Java engines, cloud services from AWS, Microsoft Azure, and Google. So any language that supports these frameworks and tools will always give you a higher pay. Let's find out more. First, let's talk about Scala. Scala ranked seventh this year as top paid languages, but it had a lot of potential to reach top in the coming years. The annual salary for Scala developers should be around 78,000 in 2021. Scala combines functional and object-oriented programming, which makes it a concise high-level language. Generally, the static type features in Scala are great to prevent bugs when you're writing complex code and applications. Since Scala can run on JVM and JavaScript, it becomes an efficient language to work with and you can access thousands of libraries. Scala is an immutable design, so you can enjoy parallel processing. This is one feature that makes Scala a great option for machine learning and big data. Scala lets you enjoy premium features of programming languages like conciseness, scalability, and modular alignments. Next, let's talk about Ruby. Ruby performed brilliantly last year, even though its rank came down in 2021. However, it still pays an annual salary in excess of $80,000, which is a remarkable figure. 
Ruby primarily helps development of web applications and tools. It became popular for providing services for servers across the globe. Ruby is a great language to learn regardless of how much money it can make. Simply because it has a wide variety of tools featuring powerful and easy to understand frameworks, ensuring high speed programming, featuring simplicity and clarity. Next, let's talk about Python. I've always been a huge Python fan and there are many reasons for it. Python only came down the ranking recently, but it continues to be a major player in the development world. Whether it's web development, AI, server-side programming, or game development, you'll find Python applications everywhere. This year, Python ranked fairly low as compared to previous years. However, it still paid an annual median salary of up to $59,000 and more. One of the things that makes Python so unique is its versatility. Whether you're a professional developer, teacher, student, or a beginner to the development world, there's something in Python for everyone. Some other areas where Python is very useful includes artificial intelligence, data analysis, web development, and task automation. No wonder Python is used by top companies like Google, Dropbox, YouTube, and Reddit. Even though Python ranks low this year, I still believe it will rank higher in the coming years as application of the data science becomes more in demand. Next, let's talk about Java. Java is an evergreen language and most modern frameworks and applications use Java. Therefore, skills in Java are one of the most highly in demand in the software industry. Because Java is a smooth cross-platform language, it makes it feasible option for most companies whether to use Windows or Linux or any other operating system. Thanks to the Java Virtual Machine, it's easy to find Java behind mobile apps, server applications, and more. Moreover, it's the native tool to develop Android applications as well. While these are some of my picks to cover for top paying programming languages, the list doesn't end here though. Some other programming languages that deserve a mention include Perl at $80,000 plus, Elixir $80,000 plus, Rust $77,000 plus, Go $75,000 plus, and Swift $58,000 plus. Now that you know the top paying programming languages to learn, Watch my video on the fastest way to become a software developer in 2022. See you in there.